Hello, in this session, we are going to look at your Terraform benefits. So Terraform, one of the main benefits that you have with your Terraform is uh, Terraform supports a lot of cloud providers. Uh, you can use Terraform to set up your infrastructure on various uh, cloud platforms. So to support that, it provides uh, plugins known as providers. And this allows Terraform to interact with your cloud platforms, different different cloud platforms and other services via their application programming interfaces. So HashiCorp and the Terraform community have written over 1000 providers to manage your resources on various platforms. So for example, let's say you want to manage resources on Microsoft Azure, we have a provider for that. You want to manage your resources on AWS, you have a provider for that. You want to manage your resources on GCP, you have a provider for that. So that's one main benefit that you have from Terraform. It has lots of providers that you can use. So all these providers are nothing but plugins. So you can just download those plugins and you can start writing the infrastructure for the respective cloud platform. Then Terraform allows you to standardize your deployment workflow and uh, uh, these providers, they help you to define individual units of infrastructure. For example, you can uh, provision compute instances or you can provision your networks as resources. You can compose resources from different providers into reusable Terraform configurations called modules and you can start managing them with a consistent language and workflow so uh, simply you can make your code reusable by making use of your module so later on in the sessions we will be talking about your modules as well so this terraform modules the whole point of these modules is uh, writing the code once and then trying to use the same piece of code to provision your resources for example let's say uh, you're launching an ec2 instance now today you will write some piece of code which will launch the instance now again tomorrow you have to launch the instance again likewise let's say you have to launch the instance every now and then now instead of writing the code again and again and again to provision the ec2 instance you can simply write a one-time code which we call it as your module and then we can start importing that module or we can start calling that module every time you want to launch our instances so you can make your code reusable the next benefit we have is it helps you to, you to keep track of your real infrastructure in a state file so terraform uh, uses a file called uh, terraform.tf state file which is basically a uh, record of the infrastructure that you have created so you can use this to or rather terraform uses this to keep a track of the infrastructure that we have created now this terraform state file acts as your source of truth for your environment so at any point um, you know you want to understand what are resources the terraform has created you can make use of this uh, state file to validate that so let's say for example in your aws console you have two ec2 instances and you know that you launched only one instance now how do you verify which of the instance was launched by terraform so you can make use of this terraform state file to validate that so terraform uses the state file to determine the changes to make to your infrastructure infrastructure so that it will match your configuration um, likewise let's say you're updating that infrastructure now how terraform will understand what all resources that needs to be updated so terraform uses this state file to manage your resources the next benefits we have is your collaboration so terraform allows you to collaborate on your infrastructure with its remote state backends uh, so let's say you, know, you want to collaborate with a team you want to work with uh, uh, multiple people in your team you can uh, terraform has that uh, benefit as well you can collaborate it with other people so when you use terraform cloud so we have something known as terraform cloud we will be talking about this later on uh, you can securely share your state with your teammates provide a stable environment for Terraform to run in and prevent race conditions when multiple people make configuration changes at 
one so collaboration is another benefit that your data form uh, provides uh, it, it also um, has version controlling system so you can uh, if you want to maintain different different versions if you want to manage your code you can check out your code to a version control tool and you can start managing the code so these are some of the benefits that we have with your terraform that's all for this session thank you once again please don't forget to subscribe to the channel and if you like the video leave a like and please share the video